What are homes selling for per square foot throughout North Central Washington and Eastern Washington? Hey everyone, it's Nick McLean, owner of the Nick McLean Real Estate Group, and I'm actually gonna jump on my computer and show you exactly what homes are selling for per square foot and how it can differ from home to home. So here, come take a look. So I'm, on the, I'm actually on the MLS right now. This is the Northwest MLS behind the scenes where we get all the data of all the homes that have sold. I've already clicked on homes that are under contract in the last 80 days, Chelan and Douglas County, but I can look up Yakima County, Walla Walla County, Okanagan County, anywhere your home, Grant County, anywhere your home is at that we serve, I can look it up and tell you what homes sell for per square foot. For this example, I'm gonna show you homes that are selling between four hundred and eight hundred thousand $800,000 that are newer than the year 2000 because you know the age of the home, the style of the home changes what homes sell for per square foot. Obviously, the larger the home, the, the less per square foot it's gonna sell for. And a one-level home is gonna sell different, is gonna have a different price per square foot compared to a two-level home or a daylight basement. So here, check it out. So I'm gonna go in here and you're gonna see the area matters a lot. So here's a home in Manson that's under contract at $211 a square foot, 2,300 square feet, right? There's also homes in the lookout in Lake Chelan, $631 a square foot for a home, a little cottage style home in the lookout in Lake Chelan. And then you go into Eniat. Here's a brand new construction home in Eniat under construction right now, one level selling for $336 a square foot. So many of you are thinking about building your own home and you're thinking, well, how much is it per, per square foot? Or should I just buy directly from a builder? Well, a home in Eniat, this beautiful home by Lane Construction is $336 a square foot. Over in Breckenridge in East Wenatchee, this is a two-story house under construction right now, under contract for $283 a square foot. So you can see a one-level home versus a two-level home changes the price per square foot. Breckenridge, new, same builder, $283 a square foot. $286 a square foot, same builder. Let's find a different builder. Here's a resale home, so a home that's not new construction that just hit the marketplace. One-level home in Fancher, East Wenatchee, $313 a square foot. Right, Kansas Loop built by Stamac in East, Stimac, East Wenatchee, $285 a square foot, a two-story house. Right. So a, little, a home like this is $285 a square foot. So you can see that we're seeing homes between 280 all the way up to $670 a square foot in Chelan. It can, it can vary greatly. Price per square foot can vary greatly. And the, what we look at is the style of home, the area of home, the age of home, and then we can tell you price per square foot. So if you wanna know what your home would sell for in today's market using our marketing, but based on a per square footage basis, have us come over to your house and we can look it up. In fact, you can just give us a call, 509-255-8070. That's 509-255-8070. And we'll just let you know, because I know you're not ready to put your home on the market. We'll just jump on the computer and go, okay, Yakima, two-story house built in 2000. And we can tell you price per square foot, what you should be figuring. And also what the quality and condition needs to be like to get that. Obviously a 2000 square foot home with carpets and remodeling projects, it's gonna be a lesser per square foot than a new home that's just been remodeled, right? So reach out to us, there's no obligation ever, but knowing your price per square foot can be a, a valuable way to know how to increase the value of your home and whether or not it makes, sell to, makes sense to sell your home and then build.